Incy wincy spider climbed up the spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And Incy wincy spider climbed the spout again. Welcome back, my dear children. Have you heard this rhyme before? And what is this rhyme about? The rhyme is about an insect. And what is the name of that insect? Yes, about a spider. Incy, wincy, spider. Right? The rhyme is about a spider. Right? See, this is a spider. Okay, now children, can you count the number of legs of the spider? Can you count the number of legs of the spider? Okay, we'll count together. Okay, we'll start from here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. After seven, eight. Okay, eight. There are eight legs for a spider. Most of the spiders have eight legs. Okay, so a spider has eight legs. Number eight. Eight. Number eight. So, children, today we are going to learn about the number 8. Children, now let's count some objects. So, children, what can you see here? What is the name of this shape? Yes, you can see many rectangles here, right? You can see many colorful rectangles right can you count the number of rectangles here now let's count together okay one two three four five six seven eight eight rectangles number eight eight Children, what can you see in this picture? Yes, it is a water animal. Do you know the name of this water animal? Don't know? Yes, the name of this water animal is octopus. What is the name of this water animal? Octopus. Okay, now this octopus has many arms okay it has got many arms can you count the number of arms of an octopus shall we count together okay so one two three four five six seven eight eight arms for an octopus number eight so children what can you see here some paper cups these are some paper cups you need to count the number of cups here okay now let's count let's take one by one okay i'm taking one by one one Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, so how many cups are there? Eight. Number eight. Okay, there are eight cups so children 
Now we have counted many objects, right? Okay, now let's learn how to write number 8. So children, now let's see how to write number 8. Okay, we need to start from here, from the top, make a right open curve. Then from here, make a left open curve. Then you should not stop, go back. And one more curve you need to make like this. Then you need to make again a left open curve like this and join this. Number 8. Number 8. Okay. Now let's write once again. Start from this point. Make a right open curve. Then a left open curve. Then you go up to close this one. Again go up to close this curve. Okay. Number 8. Now let's try with 3 dots. Okay. Start from here. Make a right open curve. Then a left open curve. Then make a curve to close this. Here also make a curve to close this. Number 8. Okay. Start from here. Make a right open curve. Then a left open curve. Then go up to make a to close this and again make a curve here to close this curve also. Number 8. So children we have learned how to write number 8. Now let's do a small activity. So children we have a number scramble here right. Can you see some numbers here? Yes. And a paint. Okay. We require a number scramble like this and also a paint. Okay. And what you need to do is you need to find out number 8 from this. And you need to make thumb prints on number 8. Very easy. Right. Okay. Now you find out number 8 from this number scramble. Can you find out? Point out. Okay. Now let's make a thumb print on number 8. So did you find out number 8 from this? Okay. Now let me start. Okay. So here is number 8. So I am making a thumb print. Then is this number 8? No. What about this? No. What about this? Yes. This is number 8. Number 8. Okay. Then where is number 8? Here. Number 8. Okay. Then find out where is number 8. Yes. Here. Here is number 8. So that's all. So we have 4, number 8 here, right? Number 8, number 8, number 8, number 8. So children, did you like the activity? You can even do this at home with the help of your mama. Okay, so children, today we have learned the number 8. Number 8, right? And we will learn more during our interactive classes. Okay. And that's all for today. Bye-bye.